Lance, better late than never on the goals, 45th and 90th minute. Uh, have you seen that before? Uh, I don't know that I've seen. I don't know that I've seen two goals scored that late uh, in the regulation of each half, um, back to back. I mean, you see late goals happen all the time. We talk to our players all the time about the importance of the, the first few minutes of, the, of a half and the last few minutes of a half. They talk about the important times uh, right after goals are scored. So those are things I think that are within the soccer culture are, are, are things that everyone needs to be aware of, and we, we try to educate our kids on that. But in the end, we got a corner in the, right at the end of the first half, uh, got good organization, got good service into the box, and you know whether they... Uh, whether Kelsey and, and Hannah recognized that it was that close to the end of the half or not, I'm not quite sure. There was there was some sense of urgency in what they did. Uh, Kelsey just did a good job of getting across the, the, the kid's face and, and putting the ball in the back of the net and giving us giving us a little bit of uh, a little bit of confidence going into halftime. Took a lot of shots and hadn't converted anything up to that point, so I think it was a big goal for us in the end. And then obviously at the end we were pushing and pushing and pushing and just couldn't seem to to break that membrane. Uh, and then finally, Emily got through a ball at the end and, and struck it well, put it in the corner, and uh, make it a little more comfortable. Absolutely. The consistency of the play today, how do you feel that the team's gelling so far through the season? I think they're doing really well. We, I think we played 18 or 19 kids tonight, and we've been consistently playing in that range, 20 uh, in that range of 20 players uh, in a match, which means a lot of players are able to contribute. A lot of players are, are getting experience, whether they're returning players or incoming, they're getting experience within this team and within the composition of this team. And I think that's important. We've got to learn to play well together. We've got to learn to play well alongside a variety of different players in a variety of circumstances. And so I was happy that we were able to do that again tonight. There's obviously, um, you know, there's a, there's a few, few more players on the roster than we got to play tonight, and we. Uh, we want to get those kids minutes too, uh, and that's that's part of you know I think part of us growing as a team and really recognizing when and where to use those those minutes and also you know part of converting chances, taking care of the game a little bit better. Uh, I thought although we won two 0 tonight, you know 36 shots and uh, uh, and only conceded two, which means we had a lot of the ball. We just didn't really convert it and do much with it. Uh, over the course of the last three matches, we've taken almost 100 shots. And, uh, and, cons and converted on five of them. It's not good numbers. It's one out of every 20, which is certainly, that's uh, probably about half uh, in terms of ratio, about half of what it should be. It should be around one in every 10. So we've got to do a better job of that. Not, not by shortage of working on it. Uh, we're certainly attending to it. We just have to convert. I appreciate it. Thank you. You bet. Thank you.